Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Tuesday morning. I don't know what day it is. <laughs> uh, but I was sitting down here, chilling in the morning like I usually do, and I couldn't help it but see the size of this boat. Well, it's not a boat. It's a freaking yacht. Look at this thing. You could kind of see it. I mean, it dwarfs these other boats that look big. I mean, this thing is ridiculous. I don't know how big that thing is. But that is a big boat. You imagine how much that thing... That's a yacht. That That's... I don't know what considers a yacht, but that's a yacht. <laughs> that's a big boat. Get your Cadillac out of the way. Mr. Soprano, you're in the way. But... It's a big old boat right there. I would travel the world in one of those things. <laughs> Probably need something a lot smaller, but hey. I wonder what the staff size on one of those is. That's like the 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 yacht you see in um the Wolf of Wall Street where it crashes. <laughs> anyway, I gotta get some shipping done. I got a lot of stuff to do. So I'll meet you back at the office and uh see what we sold. So I gotta get some shipping done. Not a huge amount of things. I think it's fifteen well it shows up here, fifteen items. For 1260 so got to get some stuff um, shipped here. Not a lot of things. Shouldn't take me too much. It's about 8.15 in the morning. Probably will be done before 9. And then I'll have to check out some stocks to trade for the day. Or just sit on something. I've took a lot of my money out because I do not like the market right now. So I kept myself a little little bit of money to play around with just because of the thrill. But uh, I got to get some shipping done. We'll show you what ships. All right, so here's some of the stuff that's going out. It's a very much a grab bag mix of stuff. So we'll get into some ties. Sold this Ralph Lauren, Polo Ralph Lauren teddy bear tie. Has the little tuxedo bear on it. Sold it. This sold for about 43 bucks. Plus, it's going to Canada. I think it's $10 shipping. This is a Ben Silver tie. Got $48 for this. Um, you know, a nice uh, rep stripe. Rheometrical stripe tie. Pretty nice. The ties, I think I paid on average $3 for those ties. The Ben Silver, I got a few when I was at Mr. Buys a lot. It's a place in Pennsylvania in our little... Picking a venture there. So not sure what I had into the ties from him. And then I bought a bunch last year for $6 a piece. And picked up like 30, 40 ties. And made my money back on, I think, two side tie sales. This tie I just picked up the other day. It has that little horse bit uh, pattern. This is a Salvatore Ferragamo tie. Just picked this up and it sold within about 12 hours for $60 have this Patagonia jacket. It has two little faint holes in the front. It's nothing special, really. I mean, it would have been a little bit nicer if it was in better condition. But I uh, see the two little holes here. And got $35 for this. I picked. I got this from another reseller who's getting rid of some stuff. They sent me two boxes of stuff and... I paid about $150. There was not a lot I could use after going through it. Uh, there was some stuff that was damaged, etc. And then some lower end stuff that I just don't sell. So it's kind of hard. Um, but I got a Thomas Pink shirt. This sold for $35. It's French cuff. has this nice little uh, pattern to it. Sold some Hawaiian shirts. These are all Ryan Spooner. Nice little pattern here. One of these sold for $29. Don't remember which one. And two of them sold for $34. So, and that two of them are going to the same buyer. So, these are all 2X also. All cotton. This is a Brooks Brothers shirt. And those were not on very long. They were on probably about a week or so. This Brooks Brothers shirt I just listed the other day. It was probably up two or three days. It's a, like a denim style cranberry shirt. It's extra large. Good size. 
And uh, what can I say? It's over $24 plus shipping. Shipping on everything. This is a Xenia. This is one of their newer tags. So they had missing the buttons. It's a tuxedo shirt. You can see how it's like textured here. This is a tuxedo shirt. So you'd put your own little stubs in there. There's no buttons. And this sold for $40. And, like, I don't know where, I, I can't remember half of this stuff where I picked it up. Like, the the Ryan Spooner shirts, I think I paid six bucks for those. I picked up five of them at a Savers. The Xenia shirt, I don't remember where I got that from. And they weren't listed. All that stuff is all stuff we just listed within the last week or so, including this. This is a Polo Ralph Lauren swim trunks. Got these from Brian, Mr. Buys Lot, and I buy. I'll probably make a video in the next week or so just showing some of the stuff we've sold from him, telling what we spent so I can keep track of trying to make my money back from him because I did spend a good amount of money there and then time and everything. So we'll see how that works out. But I did pick up these swim trunks, I sold them for $25 plus shipping. Then this Ralph Lauren shirt. I also got this from him. It's new at Tags. And we got $43 for this. This I picked up at a Savers. Uh, probably when the quarantine was about over. This is a guess. I mean not a guess. Why am I guessing? It's a Gucci belt. And this is... I thought it was weird. I thought it was broken at first. But it's a reverse... A reverse uh, belt. So it actually goes in behind here. And it clips in. So pretty interesting. I took an offer of that at 85 bucks. I was into this I think for $3. So not bad at all. I picked up these. These are two baseball sets from 1989. These are the Tiffany sets. These are limited edition. These are not your regular set. They're glossy. Uh, they come in these boxes, not to be compared with your other ones. I think there's only five or 6,000 sets of these every year. A lot of people get them confused because they can't tell the difference between the regular tops, which is a million copies probably, and the, the Tiffany ones, which are a higher gloss. But I sold these for $320. I actually put them on sale by accident. Didn't mean to, but it didn't matter. I was into these for about $60 each. And so there was some money to be made there. <clears throat> I bought those and really didn't want to mess with them. I was thinking about getting them, uh, getting certain cards graded in there. In this set, there's the Randy Johnson, Rookie, Craig Biggio. Um, who else? Gary Shedfield, some other players probably too, but Randy Johnson's the big one. This is a two-piece suit. I got this from Brian, Mr. Buys a Lot stuff. Um, this is brand new with tags, and you can tell the fabric on this. It's like textured. This is a like seersucker. It's cotton, so it has that textured feel to it. This is a little bit different because it's a different color. Than your normal seersucker. It's, you know. It's still at the tags. It's from Joseph A. Bank. I mean. Joseph A. Bank is nothing. To, nothing all that great. But um. It's a two piece suit. We got $143 plus shipping on that one. Then I have. I mean it's a two piece suit. Sorry. This is a three piece suit. And this is an older vintage. It's like a flannel. It's this gray and like blue. It's really hard to see. Right there. I've had this a while. And I picked this up at a half off day somewhere for like three bucks. I probably should have left it behind. But it did sell for $40. I kind of just shot somebody an offer because they were interested. And then this is just your typical dark blue Brooks Brothers uh, gold button blazer you know find these a dime a dozen some the, if you could find the newer tags and good sizes they will do well but i 
got 85 plus shipping on this. And that's all that's going out today. So I got to go run another eBay sale and uh, get some shipping done. I run a sale usually twice a week. I get a lot of questions on that. And, um, man, it ended yesterday. So I like those sales coming in. Usually I do 15%. It's pretty consistent. And then I shoot people offers probably usually twice a day. It's all about selling this stuff. I'm not hoarding it. I want to make money. I want that boat I seen earlier. 